Right now, the world is celebrating the release of three American hostages from North Korea. Tony Kim, Kim Hak Song, and Kim Dong Chul have been reunited with their families, and the world is uh, rejoicing uh, along with their families and along with them. Uh, these men were academics. Uh, they were hotel company representatives. They uh, were regular ordinary citizens who lost their freedom uh, due to the evil of the North Korean regime. But as these three hostages get released, uh, a new hostage situation is forming. Here is a photo of Mike Pompeo with Kim Jong-un. And that is a firm handshake right there that our Secretary of State is giving to the North Korean leader. Kim Jong-un looks like he's crying in that picture. And Mike Pompeo obviously looks like he's smiling. So uh, new video footage has just been released and it's on our site now. Um, showing the meeting that occurred between Mike Pompeo and Kim Jong-un. And uh, this was uh, ahead of the release of these hostages. So obviously a major win for uh, the United States, for President Donald Trump, for Mike Pompeo and for the team. Um, but more work is to, uh, yet to be done uh, going into the uh, meeting between Kim Jong-un and President Trump. Um, but this is a, a massive moment in, in, in world history um, and uh, anybody who saw President Donald Trump coming off the plane with those three men will remember where they were when they saw that image. And uh, this image right here is a very good image to be, uh, be sending out to the world because this shows that Mike Pompeo has not taken any guff from this kid Kim Jong-un. And uh, Kim Jong-un is on the ropes, it looks like, and the, the maximum pressure campaign is working. Uh, we're going to keep uh, reporting on this, but, you know, obviously all we can really say is that we're just uh, overjoyed uh, with the rest of the world today. It's, uh, it's a momentous occasion. Uh, please keep reading BigLeaguePolitics.com.